today we will see a topic that comes under nursing research so this is very important topic uh, in our uh, nursing research process uh, when when the researcher doing the research and uh, he or she is keeping the research in our hand in their hand then there will not be use whatever the research findings and the fact that has to be communicated communicated this will leads to research utilization and evidence based practice in our nursing field so for the communication what is needed that is the nursing research report so our topic today is nursing research report so first we'll see what is the meaning of research report it is a condensed or summary of the uh, uh, research process that the researcher has done or it is a end product or overall summary of the nursing research uh, that the researcher has done so that is known as the research report end of the uh, research whatever the findings the researcher is giving that is known as the research report so next we'll see what are the purposes of the research report uh, first one is uh, it can present in the conferences it can presents in the journal as articles and it can publish in the books like thesis and the dissertation and it can uh, give the financial aid and it can be utilized and uh, uh, applications in our nursing research education and administration next we'll see what are the characteristics of the nursing research report so first one is conciseness conciseness means brevity shortness should be there the whatever the comprehensive uh, research content that the detailed uh, the researcher has done it has to be uh, made in a concise or short manner then the readers will be very much uh, easily they can be understandable second one is clarity the content of the research report has to be uh, clear cut information or the ideas and the readers will be very much benefited with the information or the knowledge and third one is honesty so whatever the research product or the report it should be in a uh, free from bias or the jargons or the errors and uh, uh, no fraud should be done so that will have a honesty and have a relationship between the reader and the researcher and uh, next one is uh, uh, completeness whatever the research uh, uh, report uh, work it should have a logical sequences complete uh, will be there from top to bottom uh, whatever the researcher findings it should have a uh, completeness then the researchers will be satisfied by the research report and last one is accuracy accurate information has to be given and it should be simple and clear and uh, knowledgeable for the uh, readers so these are the uh, important characteristics of the research report next we'll see uh, what are the guidelines that has to be uh, follow while preparing the nursing research report uh, first one is it should based on the objective so whatever the objective of the study the researchers has to be made the research uh, report second one is it should have a gathering the uh, knowledge or improve the thinking so what the research report will uh, improves the thinking level of the readers and improve the knowledge of the leaders and uh, next one is uh, it should be used as simple language simple easily understandable language has to be used uh, and free from uh, technical bias or the errors or technical languages has to be reduced and next one is uh, uh, the sentence has to be formed as a present tense not as a past tense and uh, in the research report they can be add the aviates uh, then it will be beneficial for the uh, listeners or the uh, readers and uh, it should be uh, attractive for the uh, readers whatever the research report uh, they have uh, made and uh, the research report should be confidential enough and this will uh, give a uh, very good bonding between the researchers and the readers so these are the some of the points or the guidelines they has to be remember while preparing the nursing research report next we'll see what are the uh, process of uh, nursing research report uh, process first one is uh, gathering the uh, baseline uh, data so whatever the uh, data is there of the research they have to be uh, collect all the data and that has to be in a logical and sequence manner logical means uh, 
uh, first they have to mentally think how we can uh, uh, return the uh, data. Then next one is sequentially they have to arrange it. So that is the first step. Second one is preparation of the uh, outline, final outline. So uh, whatever the research the researcher has done, uh, the content has to be longly uh, written enough and they have to make a uh, draft uh, outline has to be prepared. The third one is preparation of the final draft uh, that is a rough draft, uh, rough uh, copy has to be prepared. In the rough copies we have to identify what is the limitations, whatever the detailed uh, data based on the paragraph subheadings. Uh, uh, they can be made and methodology uh, what, uh, what are the research work they have done we can identify from this rough uh, draft. The next one is uh, preparation of the uh, revising, polishing and uh, reviewing the data. So revising, polishing and reviewing the return data. So when we can identify what language, what is the technical bias, any grammar mistake is there, uh, what are the figures, what are the tables, how they have uh, uh, made it in a front is that all we can have a ideas and we can uh, correct the uh, detailing the uh, draft, whatever the draft they have preparing in the reviewing, polishing and revising the data. Next one is uh, we have to preparation of the final draft one. So after removing all the return work, all the draft, then final draft has to be uh, written and kept ready for the further procedure. The next one is we have to arranging the bibliography and what is the style is needed, what are the reference we can make it. The last one is documentation and next we can go with the editing of the nursing research report. So these are the step that comes under the nursing research report. So next we will see what are the types of uh, uh, research reports. So types of uh, research report, first one is uh, uh, verbal report is there. So verbal report, the researcher when, when he complete the research, uh, they can uh, give the report uh, presentation uh, as a formal meeting or informal meeting, formal uh, like uh, uh, workshop, conferences. So there they can go with a presentation with PPT or like, uh, they can go with 20 to 30 minutes of presentation. So the findings can be communicated or disseminated to the other nursing professionals. Second one is uh, return. Return uh, type uh, they can uh, have technical report is there, popular report is there. In our nursing field we can uh, go in uh, article publishing in our journals like abstract we can send in the journals or like comprehensive way we can uh, uh, prepare the draft like uh, uh, thesis and the uh, uh, books can be uh, preferred, dissertation books can be preferred. And last one is a poster presentation. So, uh, during any uh, uh, program formal meetings, they can go with the poster presentations. AV8 can be prepared and this can be uh, attractive in manners and uh, nicely the reader or the uh, listener can easily understand what is the finding of the research uh, report. So, these are the different types of uh, research report. So, next uh, we will see uh, on format of uh, nursing research report. In the format first one is preliminary preliminary page is there. In the preliminary page uh, so they have to see uh, uh, what is the work done, bona fide certificate and what is the acknowledgement and uh, next uh, list of figures, list of uh, tables. Uh, so that uh, has to be arranged. Then next one is body. Body consists of uh, introductions of the research, need for the study, background of the study, what is the research problem and uh, what is the objectives, assumptions, uh, variables, hypothesis has to be mentioned. Then next review of literature. Uh, next one is methodology. In the methodology, research approach, research design. Uh, then next, uh, what is the uh, setting, what is the population, sample, sampling technique, uh, what is the data collection method, procedure, what is the method of data analysis. Uh, next one is uh, ethical clearance uh, has to be mentioned. Then next uh, discussion, uh, uh, limitations, uh, uh, summary, conclusions. Before that we can see the result chapter. Result also, interpretation of the result. Uh, then next, whatever the tables, figures that is used and how the objectives and how the hypothesis has interpreted that can be mentioned. And last one is uh, like references, uh, books, uh, APA model uh, can be used or MLA model can be used in the bibliography 
styles uh, like books books journals reference nest net reference can be included so this will be varied uh, in books uh, like a thesis dissertation or articles publication uh, in our uh, journals or poster presentation it will be different next we will see what is the functions of nursing research report so functions uh, uh, first one is uh, this will give the uh, confidence of the researcher it will increases the ability of the researcher what research they have done and uh, next one is it can able to communicate the research findings to the uh, nursing professionals and uh, next one is it will has a assert for a reference in our library or anywhere uh, for future uh, nurses uh, researchers they can uh, uh, refer and they can uh, study detailly this can impart the knowledge and this can be utilized and uh, uh, practice in our nursing field uh, like a nursing research nursing practice uh, uh, nursing administration and nursing education uh, and as, as a uh, nurse's role uh, we have to be very much confident in preparing the nursing uh, research report immediately after our completion of the nursing uh, research then uh, this will be benefited for ourselves and this will be benefited for our nursing profession also. Uh, so today class we have seen about what is a, a research report, what is the meaning of research report, what are the uh, characteristics, what are the purposes, what is the process, uh, what are the guidelines and uh, what is the format and what is the function. So today I am signing off Mrs. Nima, next video we will meet again. Thank you.